Good evening, you all. This is Extreme, and I'm going to take a little bit of a look at the new menu that the new game of uh, Fat Squad is uh, going to be. Uh, the game uh, Infinite Control Dark World. Yes, uh, this is the first uh, menu screen that uh, the players will see when they uh, go play the game. This is also the screen where they probably will return to after a battle. Um, so we got uh, a lot of stuff going on, on the screen. On the left and right side we got some symbols. These symbols apparently are going to provide the players the... Uh, yes, the, the, the players' victims actually. Um, to get, get some codes, you know, um, figure it out for yourself what these symbols mean and then there are rewards for you. It's going to be taking a long time I guess for you guys, but good luck with that. Oh well, that's not my problem. Uh, so we got each quarter and battle in the center of the screen. Uh, well, battle obviously brings you to battle and then it all begins. You got a couple of minutes to prepare yourself. And uh, then you got each quarter. Not sure what you're going to do over there. Well, I know some details, but more of that later. We got the world map down on the screen and the community. Some settings. Apparently you can set things, you know, settings, set, uh, uh, never mind. Map builder, yes, that's right, you get a map editor with this game. So, make a beautiful map, and maybe it becomes official, I don't know. Stuff like that. And, uh, yes, there is a star. Uh, we all know that some other games can uh, give you items, more items, even more items. And uh, then conclude with more items after that, uh, more items, uh, well you get the, you get it, okay, okay, so you get a lot of items, okay, get it, yes, you get more items, and uh, this joke is taking too long, so uh, the only thing I can see is you can actually sell and buy uh, from others. Yes, you can sell to others, buy from others um, in the store. So, uh, whatever you get, uh, somehow you can uh, trade with others. That, at least that's what they have told me. So, there you have it. No more overkill of the items. If a certain item is on the market a lot, obviously <laughs> it will drop in value, but still, uh, <laughs> there you go. Some economy going on in the game. It's own economy. Anyway, back to the world map. Not sure what they are going to do with that community. Is going to be communication, chat and stuff, and well, be nice or uh, there will be bans. Uh, right, so I guess that will be about the menu over there. So actually, we can strap uh, the screen up. I will not. No. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about some. Stuff that is going to be in a squad, like a unit editor for now. Yes, that's right, you can edit your own units for the battle. Don't worry, everyone gets the same items after researching them. You can also upgrade parts of your equipment, if you will. Well, let's just say I can give you a lot of details about that. But, um, let's keep it simple now, shall we? If you have questions, just put them down in the comments. Another video will be coming then, with the frequently asked questions like uh, the sound in the background. Oh well, never mind. Anyway, uh, unit design. So, what are you going to do? Well, you are going to research a couple of stuff like weapons and bodies. Well, with bodies I mean uh, armor, vehicles, tanks, uh, all kind of equipment and weaponry of yours. You can then uh, combine the two, that's right, you uh, say for example the light infantry is going to carry heavy cannon and then blow up some tanks, something like that. But what's more in it is that you can upgrade them as well, yes you can actually upgrade them, but before you do that you can go back to research and select a certain uh, infantry unit or uh, vehicle. 
or a weapon like the assault rifle or something like that and simply start researching attachment and modifications. Yes, you can actually upgrade your weapon indirectly by researching extra stuff for it. However, we are not stupid. Uh, before you upgrade, you can actually uh, place the attachment on a assault rifle, for example, a longer barrel. But it will make your unit more expensive for production. Yes, that barrel costs a lot. Okay, so there you have it. That, that's a little bit of an idea that... Uh, 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 never mind that. Um, that's kind of the idea that they are having uh, for this game. Okay, so there we go. Uh, any more questions in that regard? Well, not much, I guess. Um, you know what? Let, let's listen to... Uh, Actually, let, let's observe how the menu starts up again. Okay, shall we do that? Just leave something down in the comments if you have questions. Then I go deeper into what other game mechanics are offered by this key. Okay, there we go. Enjoy!